Hello Bells Palsy Ears and Facial Palsy Ears and anyone interested in the webinar on facial stretching that will take place on July 12th at 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. I just want to take a little bit of time to explain what this webinar will be about and what it will not be. Um, I have received many questions regarding it and some concern as well. Uh, and if it is, if it also if it is appropriate for all patients with facial palsy and uh, some people asking about synchinesis as well. So I want to mention that this webinar is about exposing the most amount of people to the benefit of facial stretching and massaging when dealing with facial paralysis um, and also educating them with the reason for stretching. Uh, what does it do and how does it work? Uh, what, uh, why you should be doing it? And uh, who can help you uh, with this um, further? This is by no means a full-fledged treatment that would be complete to assist you uh, with all your needs with facial paralysis because that is not possible uh, through a webinar. Each patient dealing with facial palsy comes with a different presentation, is at a different time in their healing timeline, and uh, so need different stretches and treatment approach that is appropriate for them. There is no, not one cookie cutter treatment to address your specific presentation. My goal with this webinar is to educate about stretching while demonstrating a few techniques that could be beneficial and teaching the attendees how to assess for changes from these stretches. The format of this webinar is for one hour and obviously it is not possible for me to make it an individual treatment. Um, this is what I do via online consultation. I believe this webinar will be greatly beneficial for anyone affected by Bell's palsy and that might not know or have tried any stretching. Um, if you are early in your recovery and or several months into it where you are seeing some slow changes and uh, feel some areas of tightness, I would say this webinar should be beneficial. If you are struggling with synchinesis, this is not a webinar for you. I made it clear on the landing page that this treatment is not for these patients. Treating synchinesis is much more complicated and is not treatable via a webinar. Um, Synchinetic patterns and movement behavior needs to be assessed and um, so, so are the force vector of your facial muscles in order to determine a tailored treatment to your needs, which would include some stretches. Um, but the stretches demonstrated on the webinar would likely not be either the appropriate stretch for you and or not sufficient. So um, once again, not for synchinesis. During this webinar, I want to provide with some general information regarding stretching and massage, demonstrate a few techniques that will be beneficial to most, um, again, not for synchinesis, and from the patient that I help every day and uh, the feedback I'm getting from the Bell's Palsy Solution Facebook group, I realized that most people are not referred or exposed to facial therapy, and I thought this webinar would be a good intro, introduction, a taster, if you will, um, while also offering some value with immediately applicable things while creating some interest in you getting treatment from a facial therapist, especially, especially if you are failing to see improvement in your condition. I will be able to guide you in the right direction following the webinar. If you are interested in working with a facial therapist, I can refer you to a facial therapist close to you or continue, if possible, uh, myself helping you with an online consultation. I hope this clarifies things and put more light on my intention with this webinar. Have a great one and I hope to see you then. Bye-bye.